take a couple of minutes to offer some helpful advice on how to choose a wedding photographer. The first thing you want to come up with is an overall budget for your wedding in total. Uh, once you've got that overall budget, you'll want to figure about 10 to 15 percent of that budget should go towards your photography and or videography. This is only a rough guide and you may want to spend more if photography is of more importance to you amongst your vendors um, or perhaps you might want to spend a little less than 10 to 15 percent if you feel like you don't really want all day coverage for example. I offer a variety of packages where I'm always the primary photographer. I also offer the option of booking a videographer who is a partner of mine so you can have both still and moving images. The packages that I offer, whether standard or bespoke, are created in such a way that we can work out what you'd like included in your photography package from start to finish. Once you know what you'd like to spend on your wedding photography, start to visit websites that list photographers in your area and offer links and samples of their work. Go along to their websites uh, and check out their style of photography to see if it matches your style, your emotion, the way you want your images to be portrayed from your great day. It's also a great idea to visit wedding fairs. They usually take place in the spring and in the fall. And this is a great way for you to go along and actually meet the photographers, see examples of their work, and find out about the different styles of photography that are available to you. Uh, there's a lot of titles that go along with styles of photography. Uh, a photographer might refer to themselves as uh, reportage or traditional or contemporary. Um, don't get too wrapped up in the lingo and just find a style of photography that suits you, that you can see yourself in those images. Another great way is to talk to your friends and family. Look at their wedding albums or their wall art and if you connect with those images, ask them who did their wedding photography. Uh, referrals are obviously the best way uh, to find somebody. Once you have a list of about three to five photographers whose images reflect what you'd really like to see in your wedding day, contact them for a consultation. Uh, it's really important that you meet personally with the photographers that you're considering because uh, unlike the, your cake person, um, she's not spending the whole day with you. <laughs> so you want to you wanna feel comfortable with them as well as her style of photography and let them know what your budget is and let them know what you want. Uh, obviously you can't get the whole world for a couple hundred quid. Um, so, but a lot of photographers will, will play with your ideas and try and work out some kind of compromise where you can get the most for the amount of money that you have to spend. Mm -hmm.